Hi, you're watching The Catalyst, music and weird news, and I'm your host, Kat. My top story this week is Stones Fest. It was a couple of days ago, February 22nd, at Webster Hall. The lineup was amazing, and there were a few special guests. Um, for me, the standout performances were Nora Jones singing Wild Horses, uh, Petter of Alberta Cross singing Bitch, Matt Vasquez of Delta Spirit, um, Adam Green, who I actually didn't recognize at first because he has a giant beard now, um, and Nicole Atkins because she can really well out a good tune. Uh, if you haven't been to any of these uh, fests that the Cabin Down Below presents are putting on, um, you have to get to one. Uh, Petty Fest has been going for a few years now. This was the first Stones Fest, and rumor has it that there is going to be a Neil Young Fest. But until that is confirmed, I will anxiously await Petty Fest towards the end of this year. Next up, Delta Spirit have released a teaser video for their song, their second uh, single off the new self-titled album. The song is called Empty House. Um, as I've previously mentioned, I am such a big fan of Delta Spirit, but also the direction that they have moved in with this, uh, with this new album. Um, I have full respect for a band that isn't afraid to evolve, progress, um, and not just stick with the uh, philosophy of if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Um, so I've actually listened to the album in full, and every song is just killer, it's awesome. Um, when it's out March 13th, please make sure to pick up a copy and you will not be sorry. Next up, Dear Tick have released an EP called Tim. Um, it's basically like a bonus um, little album to add to their full-length album, um, Divine Providence, which came out a few months ago. It's four unheard tracks. Well, actually, one of them is heard because um, it's an acoustic version of Main Street. Um, this EP was recorded during the same sessions that produced Divine Providence. Um, the acoustic version of Main Street was recorded um, just minutes after it had been finished, written by John McCauley, and it was the first time that he ever sang it in full. Um, like everything that Dear Tick does, it's awesome and enjoyable, and I highly suggest you pick up a copy. For now, it's only available digitally, um, but when they kick off their spring tour, they will be selling it on 10-inch vinyl at the shows. So, A, you should be at one of their shows because they are so great, and B, if you go to a show, you can buy this little EP. Um, my weird news this week is the Swedish man that got snowed in his car and survived for two whole months. Um, they're saying the key to his survival was that the air trapped in the car basically formed an igloo and he went into a state of hibernation. Um, if you think the way that I think, um, there are several questions that I want answered, but I have a feeling the answers would be pretty gross. So I think it's probably better that these things are left unknown. Well, that's it this week. Um, I look forward to the week ahead with some more music news, weird news, and hopefully some cool news. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned, and I'll see you same time next week. Bye.